What's up, Nerd for Jeansa here. This video is a little bit late because I've had to sleep all day, but I'm going to do an overview over on the um, reworked Burnavas Fate Core over here and let you know what I think about him and or her, I guess. And I'm sure everybody already came to the same conclusion as me, and that is that Burnavas sucks still. All right, so literally the only thing that they changed is they gave her another passive suppression. Where basically, whenever Burnavas uses any skill, they get marked with Retribution if they're charmed. So basically, first of all, this doesn't proc or do anything at all unless they're charmed, which means you have to have Jedi on your team, alright? But, second of all, all it does is, it basically, if, they're, if they have this mark on them, right, if they have the rep Retribution mark on them, it shocks them for one turn, right? Let me just read this make sure i got this right yeah it shocks them for one turn and the marks um last three turns but both of burnamas's skills already shock anyway so basically you just double cc you're stacking cc on top of cc now what some people are um theorizing is that the mark can't be um the mark can't be cleansed Whereas shock can be cleansed, and since the mark will proc at the beginning of each turn, basically you you have a CC that can't be removed by um, like heals, because every single heal in the game cleanses. Um, so, but that's it, right? And that's I don't really think that's enough. I don't really worry too much about cleanses or anything in arena right now. I don't really worry about it too much in PvE right now. Not to mention when it comes to PvE, I don't know where you're going to be using um, FC Burnavas and Janai together. Like where and what content, you know? So, honestly, they really missed the mark with this rework in my opinion. Um, Burnavas, right, his... The good thing a part of, about his kit right, before the rework, was that he has a bunch of CC, right, he has a bunch of crowd control, which means if you want to buff them, rework them, if someone has already a bunch of CC but still isn't good, it means you have to, one, make them tankier, two, give them more damage, or three, give them some other type of utility, right, but they didn't do that, they just took the good part of the character and then stacked on top, on top of it, literally on top of it, right? It's not even like he got even more CC that, you know, like, I don't, I don't know, like before he shocks, but now he shocks and then, I don't know, does something else or like he, everything became AOE. So he AOE shocks everybody all the time or something. You know what I mean? It's not like they gave him even more CC. They literally took crowd control and stacked it right on top of the crowd control that he already has or she already has and that's it so if you didn't think Burnavas was good before which i feel like nobody did not good now either all right even if the mark can't be cleansed which means you have a cc that can't be cleansed it's like maybe sometime in the future it will be useful in a specific kind of niche that's it right and PvP wise, it also means that you're still gonna get, um, you're still gonna get screwed over by the machine set, um, Guardian Stone set, right? Because it makes you immune to CC or immune to negative defects, right? So, yeah, that's it. Don't pull. Do not pull. Complete waste. Complete waste of Zez. All right. Anyway, I'm out. Peace.